Generative AI tools such as ChatGPT have been at the forefront of technological advancement, but concerns have been arisen regarding their potential risks and impact. In response, national and international governing bodies have begun taking steps to regulate these tools. Now, this opening was actually written by ChatGPT, and it seems that it has a great knowledge of what it has been facing. The European Parliament lawmakers just approved an AI Act, making it closer to becoming law. Italy even once imposed, though later lifted, a temporary ban on the use of ChatGPT. Other countries like Australia and Britain are planning regulations on AI. China, on the other hand, has moved faster than elsewhere to regulate the nascent field. Draft regulations on generative AI products issued by the Cyberspace Administration of China in April require service providers to avoid various forms of discrimination, um, fake news, terrorism, and other anti-social content. Now, I know many users are concerned about their privacy. So in this draft, the chatbots are not allowed to profile users based on their input, nor provide personal information or users' input to others. China's speed is not surprising considering the government's take on data privacy. Violation of rules can result in fines of up to 100,000 yuan and worse, service termination. But still, this draft expressed its overall attitude towards this kind of uh, AI products, which is supporting and encouraging the generative AI industry. So what do you think of the latest moves these governing bodies are taking to regulate generative AI tools like you? The regulation of generative AI tools, including language models like me, has become a subject of increasing interest and debate. It is important for governing bodies to engage in ongoing dialogue with experts, researchers, developers, and other stakeholders to develop responsible and effective regulatory frameworks. Ultimately, the goal is to establish a framework that fosters innovation, protects against misuse, ensures transparency, and upholds societal values.